Hello, so this video has been suggested quite a few times and if you're one of those people, here you go. The top seven worst insect stings in the world. These stings are based off the Schmidt Pain Index, which has sort of been adopted as the interim measurement of pain for around the world. Just sting pain, they're not like, oh, just sting pain. A four is the most excruciating pain and a number one is sort of like that of a sweat bee, which isn't really a sting. I mean, it's a sting, but it doesn't really hurt that much. All that stuff, who first looked at a beehive and thought, I bet they're hiding something delicious in there? Mm -mm -mm. I mean, Good, good on you for finding honey like that, but, but that's a risky move. Starting off the list at number seven with a pain reading of two is the bold-faced hornet. They're found in North America and the worker hornets are very aggressive, which is great news. It's lucky that they're small as well because they eat anything edible. So if they're a bit bigger, they'd eat us. They'd eat humans. That's how crazy it is. According to Schmidt, the sting of a bald-faced hornet is similar to getting your hand crushed in a revolving door. Coming in at number six again with a pain reading of two is the yellow jacket wasp. It's found pretty much Everywhere. You've probably been stung by the wasp. I know I have. And I would probably hate it if it wasn't really good for the world's ecosystem. The analogy Smith used to describe this sting is, imagine W.C. Fields extinguishing a cigar on your tongue, which is pretty apt, to be fair. Number five, again, with a pain reading of two, is the honeybee. You know the honeybee. I know the honeybee. We all know the honeybee. We love the honeybee. Yes, honeybee. You go, honeybee. We all forgive the honeybee. Oh, honeybee, you've stung me. That's okay, honeybee. I forgive you. You give me honey. I love you. There are actually only seven different types of honeybee, but this one has the worst sting, and Schmidt says, the sensation is like a match head that flips off and burns on your skin. The Red Harvester Ant is number four with the Smith Pain reading of three. Remember that film Ant? Remember that? I loved that film. All the ants were so cute, it was lovely. Well, this ant is nothing like that. They're found in the Southwest USA and the sting is described as bold and unrelenting, as if somebody's using a drill to excavate your ingrown toenail. Number three has a pain reading of three. It's another wasp, the paper wasp, which surprisingly isn't an origami wasp, but an actual insect. There are about a thousand different species of the paper wasp, which, oh, I can't think of anything better. Really can't. They're found all around the world and Schmidt's of the sting, it's got a distinctly bitter aftertaste, like spilling a beaker of hydrochloric acid onto a paper cut. Fuck, actually, really, that sounds horrible. The tarantula hawk has the coolest and most terrifying name on this list, and is also number two with a pain reading of four. Let's be honest, tarantula hawk would be a great superhero name, you know. I am tarantula hawk. The tarantula hawk is a spider wasp that hunts tarantulas. So yeah. Cool, stay away from that. They literally have grappling hook legs so they can lock in and sting you better. They're found on every continent apart from Europe and the sting is apparently blindingly, shockingly electric, as though a running hairdryer has been dropped into your bubble bath. And finally, at number one, we have the bullet ant. Now, I've spoken about this ant before in previous videos, so you know it's not nice. The pain lasts for several hours and there's actually a ritual in a tribe where you have to wear gloves interwoven with these insects. They repeatedly sting you to the point where your arms are paralyzed. For a bit, not forever. On the Schmidt Pain Index, the bullet ant is a four plus, and the sting is described as like fire walking over flaming charcoal with a three inch rusty nail grinding into your heel. Which is so descriptive of pain, that's insane. Anyway, thanks for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. This is my Snapchat, my Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook links are down below. I'll see you guys very soon, goodbye. Also, if you wanted to watch a video about the world's biggest insect, I made a video about that, just link, it's just there. Or it's just down there. Thank you, goodbye.